Hey, Flight Crazed here, doing a review of the Eosheen's E55 foldable pocket drone. So, this was sent to me by Banggood for a review. And, uh, as you can see, it got a little crunched in the uh, shipping process, but uh, no damage whatsoever to the drone. Yay! Alright, so this is what comes in the package. You get uh, a little pouch to carry your drone in, you get your charger, you get your screwdriver, change your props, and two extra props. So, okay, so here we go. We're going to unfold this thing and see what we look like. Grab a hold of it. Got a little fuzz on that prop there. Probably one of my wife's hairs. Alright. That was really tough. So there we have it, all unfolded. Nice, compact. I like the power button. You can leave your battery plugged in. Nice little battery bay with a closable hatch. Leave it plugged in. You can just turn it on. Nice little LEDs. This has a a pretty decent camera. I was very impressed with the actual video quality and the picture quality. Um, you know, it's no 16 megapixel camera or anything, but for what it is, for a quick pocket selfie drone, I, I like it. Uh, I'm not too great at flying it with the phone controls. I think with an actual transmitter it would uh, actually be a little better, but uh, I think it's something that I could get used to. Um, especially if I'm just, you know, out somewhere and I happen to have it with me, I can just take it out without a transmitter and pop it in the air and take a couple of short videos of maybe a nice sunset or something. Or some good pictures of, uh, you know, me and my wife or something. So, what do you say we take this thing outside and get some video and see how, how we look? Nice picture. We got a pretty good breeze going here, so I'm not real sure how this is going to work. So let's give it a shot. Here we go. I'm going to go into gravity mode. Oh, and it goes right into the wall. That wasn't good. Okay, so here we are. Bound. We're going to hit our altitude hold. Back up here, I'm going to hit this takeoff. We're going to take off. All right, let's get this down just a little bit. So this is an altitude hold. You can see it, it'll pretty much stay. Well, it's kind of going down, isn't it? So it's not holding great. All right, let's just hold it right there. Let's try this uh, draw a pattern. Whoa, man, we fly right into the wall there okay so that was an attempt at uh, the track mode to draw a track on there and make it do what it's going to do and that was very unsuccessful so we're going to put it back in the air it actually I'm surprised it hit that wall pretty good and it it's maintaining pretty decent not bad not bad not bad alright let's go ahead and record some video All right, so there we have a video. Let's uh, take that off and take some snapshots. All right, there's a picture. Wind is moving it around a little bit. It's kind of hard to hold it still. Let's let go of the sticks. That's completely let go. You can see it's wanting to travel. So I'm kind of trying to demonstrate this in a little more wind than you'd want to use it in, I think. It's not bad, not bad. I mean, it's very controllable. Let's get this down just a little bit. There we go, that's a better belt. That's, a, there we go. All 
All right, let's put it on 3D mode and let's see what it does. Whoa. Okay, this is very hard to control. I'm going to land it. Come on, land. There we go.